He finna be some mad. Like his own, man. His own. Yes, sir. Four days away. It's our time. It's time for mental preparation. It's time to get ready for war. We're gonna go through these events, but really we're getting ready for war right now. Mentally, that's what counts the most. Today or tomorrow, get it out the way. Got a, got a good feeling about this fight. Good feeling. Don't blink. Thanks all for coming here today, ahead of a huge fight on Saturday, live on DAZN, of course, the 140 pound unification matchup between WBO world champion Maurice Hooker and WBC champion Jose Ramirez. I constantly get great opportunities to, you know, showcase my skills and showcase, you know, what dedication can do. Because as everybody knows, I'm pretty young in the sport, but I'm super dedicated to the sport. I, every day I'm, I'm working on it physically and mentally and it's showing and it's it's a blessing for me. Julio Diaz, I want him next. So if not, give me a unification, but Julio Diaz, you next buddy. You know, it's been a great training camp. I feel I feel very motivated. Uh, this is something that I dreamed of once I became a world champion is to go out to all the the rest of the champions and Maurice Sucre was the only one available. And in order for that fight to happen, I had to come to his back, you know, backyard, but that wasn't gonna stop me. I'm ready. I'm ready to go one round. I'm ready to go two rounds. I'm ready to go 12 if I had to. But the way Jose fight, I think I'm gonna be in early because he's gonna uh, run right to my right hand. For me, this is the 2019 fight of the year. I truly believe you will see that at College Park on Saturday night. Do not miss this fight live and exclusive on the zone across America, the zone globally across their platforms and also Sky Sports in the UK. Maurice Hooker against Jose Ramirez, the WBO and WBC unification fight. I just wanted to be active for real, for real. I know in boxing, you can't really control what go on for real, for real. Like, you know, everybody on different sides of the um, board, you know, different teams. So it's hard to really put your energy into that. You know, I, I, I learned in life, you can't, if you can't control it, don't worry about it. So if, 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 if it happens, that's great. But if it don't, fine too, you know? I'm gonna keep doing what I'm doing to build my legacy and what, what needs to be done. So they gotta do the same thing. If the fight's presented so, hell yeah, I want them. But if they don't, I'm, I won't mind. Do you see this fight as being a closer type of fight to that where you might have to get off the canvas to beat him? Or do you think you're gonna be so dominant over him, you're not gonna have any issues? I tell everybody, this fight gonna be a war. I'm lying, this fight gonna be no war. I, I plan I plan on going in the ring and just outbox him. Make him look dumb. Like he got outboxed his last fight against a southpaw, a little shorter guy, short uh, short guy. And uh, that's the reason why I ain't gonna fight him in, uh, in California. Cause look at his last fight. It could easily been a draw. 
or he could have lost. But this fight, I just I feel like I would outbox him and uh, show my skills. You know, I think he would bring out the best. You don't think he's gonna be able to lure you into no, the kind of fights he's used to? No, I'm just taking my time, be patient, and win round by round, and have fun with him. Instincts going no, looking bad like a bat with an eye patch. All black through the woods with a backpack and a lit match. Spark one time, get the whole city looking like a dark set of orange when I burn it down. Yeah, what it is, what it do, whole click getting live. I'm the talk of the town, I'm a city had a mouth and it wouldn't shut up. On a hunt for a crown, when I get it, I'ma burn it cause nobody in the game right now even deserve it. What it is, the crown for it anyway. I should have a halo the way that I'm independent, turn the gold and a pen if you got thoughts about a pen if you sold. You know you want the riches and the money and the fancy chicken.